and welcome back here to the channel Ami Rabbit. We're here on a Star Corsa in the HDC 350Z, doing a little shakedown of the new rig and getting used to the car. So, before we get into that, a big congratulations to Bama for the entry into the Team Evil Rabbit main team. He has definitely been around for a very long while. Back in the Forza Motorsports 7 days when I was competing in SSR and working for ESDA, I've tandem with him a bunch of times, so it's definitely great to be able to add him to the main team here on Assetto Corsa. So, a different perspective for you guys today of the rig, kind of showcasing the, you know, the Energy Innovations Sim chassis here for today. So, and getting used back to used to this Z because to this weekend on Sunday is HDC round one, so we gotta get kind of back in the flow, get used to the seating position and everything that I'm in now with this chassis and everything of that nature. So once again, a big congratulations and welcome to Bama to the main team and a big thank you to, whoa, we hit the curb there. A big thank you to Drift Snacks for making that entry cinematic for Bama possible. Drift Snacks always coming in clutch for me with the cinematics. So big thank you to Drift Snacks. If you guys do not follow Drift Snacks on YouTube, make sure you guys follow him. His information will be in the description box below. So Bama, great entry into the main team, which brings in the question of the street team. So we are gonna be having a team meeting here very soon. We have a bunch of prospects that we are looking into bringing into the street team. So that will be coming here very shortly. I didn't think I was gonna make that. I'm actually uh, very off placement with the Z right now and I need to get back into the swing of things with the Z before this weekend with round one. Gonna be a flipping, flipping mess. Oh God. Oh God. Oh, oh, oh God. Well, <clears throat> restart. So <laughs> round one of HCC is definitely gonna be a very big thing with some very big talent coming into the rounds. Hexer and them are putting on a huge thing with that round. So precision driving as well as time base is going to be very important for a win. So got to get back in the swing of things with this car going from the street cars that I've been driving so much recently on the server with you guys in the community to oh, my 800 some horsepower V8 350. So the physics and the driving characteristics are kind of very similar. It's just the wheel spin and everything that I got to get back used to. And that's why we're shaking it down here on this very sweepy mountain road. So once again, a big welcome to Bama into the main team. And the prospects for the street team will be announced here very shortly. We're going to have a team meeting. So I hope you guys are enjoying all the server content and the discord if you guys are not part of the discord and not part of the community make sure you guys join the discord get part of the community and the server all of which are found to be in the description box below got a lot to do in the next few days with the z to get ready for round one i don't want to be that that slouch guy that knocks every cone over or runs really slow so i gotta focus down this weekend and get my lines and everything down with this car and get more comfortable in it because it's definitely very different going from street cars to comp cars Ooh. a lot of people can relate or some people may not be able to relate it's a huge difference going from a car that oh don't hit don't fall off a car that has you know a couple hundred horsepower to something that's close to a thousand horsepower and on super grippy tires where wheel spin is a major factor and we're just trying to shake down the new rig because the seating position and everything is a little bit different than what I'm used to on my hand-built wooden rig so I gotta get used to the placement and the feel of the wheel because you wouldn't think that just a few I guess centimeters would make that big of a difference on how it feels but it does you know, wheel placement and seating position is a big thing for drivers and drifters. It's If it's not right, it feels very weird. So something I got to get used to with this rig, my handbrake and shifter and everything are kind of in different places. Now this car is set to sequential, so 
There will be no mist shifting or anything like that in competition. We're getting into the fun parts of this track. So that's one thing I made a point to do with this car is do a sequential. I can't see anything. I can't see anything! A sequential because going from gear to gear and mist shifting in a competition is a big problem. That's why a lot of FD drivers and everything run dog boxes or sequential gearboxes because the chance of mist shifting is not there. So, I hope you guys, like I said, are enjoying the server and everything that I'm throwing out. Got an add-on pack coming to the channel and to the server with some uh, updated cars, some more street cars and things of that nature. That's a really dirty Forza E-Brake grab. That's a really bad, nasty lock, though, but we got this. The car is definitely very different than the street car, so we got to shake this down, shake down the rig, get used to the seating position before this Sunday. So, make sure you guys follow me on all social media, all of which are found in the description box below. Oh, we got this. We're going to finish this out, though, because, you know, we're not going to... Screw up the track. So this is just a different perspective for today's video. This is not going to be how the wheel cam and everything is set normally, unless you guys enjoy this video be, or this style of camera. We're going to be throwing on some other cameras, maybe a camera that looks down at the wheel as well as my foot placement and my facial expressions and things of that nature so let me know what you guys think down in the comment section down below if you guys aren't a part of the discord make sure you guys join the discord which will be in the description box below we are upwards of five almost 600 people in the discord server so as always i thank you guys for coming back and watching i'm evil rabbit i'll see you guys on the track